Today's daily dose of math is using a scale diagram. This picture of a house is a scale diagram, but we are not given a scale. We are given a measure of one wall of the house. We are asked to find the scale and use it to find the diameter of the circular window and also to find the area of that window. The first thing that we have to do is measure the wall of the house. We know that the real measure is 8 meters and the ruler measure is 3.5 centimeters. Therefore I'm able to put those two numbers together and I have a scale for this diagram. 3.5 centimeters ruler represents 8 meters real. Now to find the diameter of the window I have to measure again. When I measure this diameter, I get 1.2 centimeters. I can use this value to make a proportion. I take my scale, 3.5 over 8, and I put it in an equation. On the other side, I have 1.2 over x. Because the ruler measure is on top on the left side, the ruler measure of 1.2 centimeters has to be on top on the right side and I solve this with cross multiplication. I get 3.5x equals 8 times 1.2. The 8 times 1.2 can be simplified. They multiply to give 9.6. I have 3.5x equals 9.6. If I divide both sides of this equation by 3.5, I will isolate my x. These 3.5s cancel, and x ends up being equal to 2.7 meters. That is the length of the diameter of the window. But I need the radius of the window when I do the area of a circle formula. So I need to find the radius from the diameter. Radius is always half as long as the diameter. So if I take my diameter of 2.7 and divide by 2, I get a radius of 1.35 centimeters. I plug that into the area of a circle formula. Pi is replaced with 3.14, and the r is replaced with 1.35. Remember, bed mass tells us we have to do exponents before multiplication. So the 1.35 has to be squared first before we multiply by the 3.14. 1.35 squared is 1.8225. Now that I have that, I multiply it by 3.14 and I have my final answer to the question. The area of the window is 5.7 meters squared. Don't forget to apply the unit. And remember that area units are always squared. That is today's daily dose of math. Please like, subscribe, and share.